everybody. Welcome to the Flashcast. We have a super, super exciting show for you all planned today. You know why? Because we have a special guest. I'm sitting here with Matt Rolino, our special guest John Fisher, and we got Sam Predabon, as we usually do. We're very excited the show's going to be. Through some feat of science, we've managed to clone Matt, and now we have two. I think we Clever. cloned Fisher. Fisher was first. So. Well, we got clones, we and got that's clones. my favorite part of the entire to bring in the science somehow. It's there been a you while. Go. You know what? First topic. First topic. So, okay. Eddie, first topic. Let's kick it off. Look how similar their hair is. <laughs> <laughs> now, stop stealing Fisher's topics. Oh, <laughs> I'm just a guest here. <laughs> first topic for real. Okay. So, this dude, I'm not sure where he was from. Didn't say in the article. Mm -hmm. No, wait. Did it? Might have been Virginia. Anyway. An Australian man from Virginia? I didn't say Australian man. So I'm pretty guy. sure you said Australian Did man. Did I? I think you yeah. said Australian. Well, it's not he Australian man. This Australian. man's from Virginia, and he gets home. He gets home like a uh, mm -hmm. bad day at work. His wife didn't make dinner, so he gets really mad. Mm -hmm. Like, he starts yelling. She leaves, goes to the neighbor's house. She looks out the window. He's walking away from their house, and it's on fire. Well... Was the fire department called, or um, this, I don't know. Do you know he lit it on fire because she didn't make him dinner. Uh, I, know yes. that, I know how that feels. You know what I'm thinking? <laughs> actually, <laughs> when you, you know what I'm talking about. Right? <laughs> you know what I'm thinking actually happened? She did make him dinner. She forgot about it, left it in the oven, and it caught on fire. What this man the, is innocent. What if the dinner was so bad that yeah, it, that was, it, it, about it, to say he that. needed to heat it up a little bit? It was too there cold. There you go. The microwave, microwave was broke. broken. Well, apparently, it was just that bad that he, he walks decided in, to set it on fire. He walks in. She didn't have it on the table, right? And he's like, "What the? What is this? I'm angry." Mm -hmm. He gets real mad. She leaves out of fear, goes to the neighbor's house. So he did the rational thing. Right, lights the house on fire. It's very oh, rational. Oh, of course. I mean, like that's how you progress. No mm -hmm. dinner, house goes on fire. Simple as that. Well, now, we're in a 21st century society. Right. Are we really supposed to be wondering when the woman is going to make dinner? Can guys have those TV dinners? We have pizza, Chinese. I'm always going happier out. with those. Yeah. You are with Yeah, I like just, I just like food. I yeah. In front of me. I like being able to make food me, when I'm I gonna, want. Yeah. I'm not going to turn it down. Well, it shouldn't uh. be the girlfriend's job or the wife's job to make it. I mean, right. that guy has some issues, clearly. Yeah. Um, are you saying that because Brooke's Yeah, you're saying that because the girlfriend's up in the studio. <laughs> Who's that? <laughs> I don't know. Either way, he's getting points. We'll move on to the next topic. We are in the state. Go to this camera. <laughs> we are in the wow, state this is so direct. of emergency. <laughs> Amazing. The Earth is running out of helium. And because of that, the United States feels the need to create a new law. It hasn't gone through yet, but it could. Where it would make party balloons filled with helium illegal. Many three-year-olds are going to be very, very upset. And clowns are going to be out of work. Mm -hmm. How are we going to increase our I don't voices? Think yeah, the, I, I, I don't think they realize the, the economic implications that this could have. You know? um, keep, people keep inhaling helium to sound hilarious. What are we going to do with that? I, I mean, apparently what's happening is helium is escaping from our atmosphere, and we can't get it back, uh, despite it being the second most abundant element in the universe. Next week, can you guys start out with, like, because I'm not going to be on the show next week. Right. I'll have my normal night class, but helium, helium voices, voices to open the show. Can you guys do that? Before it's illegal, Before I think it's we illegal. should do that. That would be cool. Yeah. Be cool. Here's, here's, yeah, here's a fun fact, we though. I didn't know that. this. You guys know what is the biggest use of helium in the world right now, though? Balloons? No. Blimps. Blimps. X-ray machines. X-ray oh, machines. And that's why they're so concerned we'll run out of helium, because X-rays need helium to work, apparently. Well, then what's more prevalent, running out of oil or running out of helium? What's more important, I don't high know. voices or running out of helium? I think high voices. I definitely say high voices. I'd agree. Yeah, probably. All right. Fisher doesn't know what his topic is, because we no, told I him don't. we'd surprise I him. Sam mentioned it already. I did. The topic we're going to talk about <laughs> oh God. is why did you copy his look, Matt? <laughs> when? Why, why did you copy I, my look? He came first. So like, yeah? I did come yeah. first. I was born two years I don't know. before I, you. Yeah, my yeah. Name, your name came from my name. I'm taller than you. I'm you're stronger than you. Oh, yeah. Okay. okay. I was fish. like, wait. Yeah, I'm stronger John? than you. <laughs> I don't think you're taller than me. You I have smaller than hands you. than me. Well, I don't know that. that's, 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 they're not that bad, but that's. Yeah. that's they are close in private. height. It's a private. <laughs> it's a private matter, Matt. Why did you copy me? I mean, I copied your hair just be, just to point it out mm -hmm. tonight. And your wardrobe. 
I mean, not right now, but usually you you always copy. You have the backwards hat. You have the shorts on. The I mean, that's ball first. shoes. This You're like a John Fisher hipster. Okay, yeah, John that's exactly Fisher. that was <laughs> Am my I goal. The original hipster, then. You are the original. Just, John Fisher I was John him. Fisher before. John I saw was cool. him at TVT yeah. last year, and I just you did. Thought, you were there. Yeah, I was there. I don't remember. I know. He didn't get I didn't anything, introduce me to you. He didn't get to do anything. Because these yeah. guys were just like, oh, we're too good to hang out with the it people who don't know how to. Yeah. 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 Isn't the director, he said the same thing earlier. The director, yeah, yeah. he said he was, yeah. he was too good. So, so you, you, know, you could have approached me. I'm very approachable, <laughs> so I've heard. All you did do was come say hi, and you wanted to be me. And personally, I, don't, I would never wish that upon anybody. So flattering. See, isn't this, this is some of the hard-hitting news that we do here on Flashcast. Oh, I'm really glad. All of right. course. Thank you for having this conversation, man, with us. You can yeah, you're, okay. You're a, you're a good sport. <laughs> you're a good sport. <laughs> yeah. Fisher. Yeah. You're a very good sport. Yeah. All right. I don't have one more topic, or is that later? That's, yeah, that's, that's later. Okay. Oh, come up with I'm another one. <laughs> it's cool. We'll get it. It's yeah, all good. It's all right. It's all right. All right. right. You're up. So, a fan at a Buffalo Bills game, I don't know if any of you guys saw I this. I saw the video. You, d- yeah, you saw I the did. video? Yeah. He fell from the upper level. He was sliding. I don't know why. I think he was drunk. He was sliding down the railing. There was nothing on the railing, <laughs> and he just falls backwards. Dude, oh, he pulled a No, he like a one a, a backflip. Back, yeah, like a backflip kind with of a barrel twist. roll. Yeah. Like a barrel roll type thing off oh, of wow. the, the level. He landed on some dude's head. Yep. And bounced two rows in front of him. Is the dude with the head dead? Like no, 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 no one's the, dead. No the casualties. Guy that, the guy that fell hurt his shoulder, and that was yes. It. The guy who fell hurt his shoulder, and then the guy who he landed on hurt his neck. They had to put yeah. him in a neck brace. Oh wow! Yeah, and, oh, wow. But the guy that fell, they put him in a neck brace as well, and on a stretcher out of the. Stadium, and he's now banned from for life from Ralph Wilson Stadium. I would assume. Yeah, I, I, would, I, would, I, would, yeah. I would hope they would do that. Not much of a loss yeah. there. They I mean, said it was reckless behavior. So I mean, if you're slightly reckless, yeah. you're filming a Joe Walton, and you decided to do a stage dive down to the floor, you'd be banned from Joe Walton as well. Uh, well, thank you for mentioning that. I will not do that. Now. Good. I was Glad. planning on it. I mean, you could slide down that. You know. <laughs> you know, that would be really funny though. Actually, when all the players funny? are yeah, no, like all the players are walking down the steps. Mm-hmm. To go to the field, and you take and them you all just, out in one no, swoop. No, you just go down and you just like Dang. jump between them and slide down the railing. Why not? That'd be something I would do. Don't, Why you're not? Trying to copy me some more. <laughs> My God, Matt, become original. Steal you took his idea and oh, you just God. tried to. We okay, do I'm sorry. Yeah. That's true. Me and Fisher are gonna. Everybody, look out! Your 2016. They are of soul, yogurt but you pants. are of yogurt body. Pants. Yogurt oh, pants. Are going to Chris be. Christie's nomination for Republican Party. Keep going. <laughs> all right. <laughs> Next topic, ladies and gentlemen. So, as if heroin wasn't bad enough, heroin, heroin, okay, the drug, it, I, not a female hero. Yes, I. All right. So, as if heroin wasn't from. bad enough, they decided to make a substitute called crocodile. No, they didn't. And they did, and the reason this is important because crocodile has been a wa- a, uh, a around a while. Must the reason it's important is because it is booming in Canada. Like they found outbursts of it. A. Now, croc. <laughs> DNA. Crocodile. A. DNA a. Heroin A. <laughs> it eats your flesh from the inside out. Crocodile. Like a zombie. Yeah. It's like, it's like so like, say I inject it in my arm, yeah. it's going to eat everything, and my arm's just going to be bone. So it's like what a crocodile would do if it ate you. No, because it goes from the inside out. No, inside Why? out. Do, do crocodiles burrow into me? I mean, they would leave your bones. No. He's, no. He, he, they would eat the bones, too. snap off the bone. Oh, yeah. yeah that's true. Yeah, you know how sharp those teeth are? are? Learn to crocodile, please. As I was saying, no, why are people doing this? <laughs> it's actually very interesting how to make it. You get codeine and paint stop, thinner. Stop, stop. What? Paint thinner. Paint thinner is an and ingredient. And inject it into yourself? Yeah, why not? Who thought that was a good what idea? What if they inject it? Oh, paint, never mind. Like, I was thinking rainbow paint. I don't know. You can turn different <laughs> colors. Your bone. <laughs> yeah. your, you, you may not have flesh, but your bone will be a lovely magenta color. <laughs> <laughs> I might do it. Look at uh, my nice bone. I believe you. But I do believe you. Uh, oh, uh, nope, not gonna. Uh, nope. No, nope, nothing. Nope. nope Is nope, it just because nope, I'm here? Nope. Am nope. I watch embarrassing your, you? Nope. Watch your, nope. You're, you're nope. blushing. Watch your, watch your nope. mouth, Eddie. All right. They know where I was going. There, uh, over the weekend. I don't know if you guys saw this. It's been blowing up on the internet a bit. A guy released a photo gallery he did of dying, isolated civilizations. He went to 68, like a like remote civilizations where the people haven't been you know like they it's like a full tribes world. like tribal people um and he took a whole bunch of photos with them they're really really cool i didn't really know there were that many isolated like 
primitive really? tribes in the world. There's still. a lot. And like there were, every, I mean, I knew there were like a no, few no, in like, Brazil, whatever. Like African, but like Kazakhstan, oh. he went like, to, like. Middle East. Yeah, like the Middle East, stuff like that. I didn't realize there were that many I know in all particular, over the country. There's an island that no man, civilized man, has been able to set foot on because there's a tribe of cannibals there, kind of. Yeah, everyone. I was reading about man, that the other day. Me out. Is the, <laughs> me the one off of yeah. India? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they kill whoever yeah. steps on Whoever and steps on, you're them. dead, and then you just get eaten. Yeah. Um, they're dying, apparently, it's kind of sad, incest, because there's so few of them left, and yeah. they're really deformed now. But the pictures are really cool and moving, if you guys have time. You guys at home, too. Check them out. They're really worth well, Only if you want a good, seeing. like, depressed Saturday afternoon. Well, <laughs> they're, very, they're real interesting, though. They're, they're real cool. Next topic for Fisher. Oh, God. <laughs> Come on, buddy. <laughs> You're like the little brother I always wanted. <laughs> Because I have a 13-year-old sister, and <laughs> she can't copy my hair, and that'd be awkward. But speaking of your hair, that's what we really want to talk about. Oh? Your hair. Oh? What type of product? Because I imagine horse shampoo. I'm so embarrassed. Um, <laughs> your hair is very strong. Do you really want to well, Hard hitting thanks, facts. Thanks, Alec. Um, <laughs> hard hitting facts. Know? Hard hitting facts. Yes. We're investigative journalists. I don't know, ask Matt. He copies whatever I do. Yeah. Matt, um, what kind of horse hair shampoo? Do you use? What, I do not use shampoo horse shampoo. Shampoo conditioner? I honestly oh, don't. I don't honestly don't even know what I use. Mayonnaise? Ooh. No? You're, you're a true man, and that speaks to what I am. Um, so here's what I, it's. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're I still in being a man we're, from we're, we're two in one. <laughs> it's, you gotta go with the herbal essences. Okay. Shampoo uh, conditioner. Very all good. Right. I, I can tell all of you at home, we can, we can make this. So do you use L'Oreal because you're worth it? Oh, because I'm worth it? No. Yeah. Herbal essences, shampoo and conditioner. We get the melon flavor. Ooh, it actually smells very good, melon. believe it or not. Mm -hmm. and you know, the scent of melon. Afterwards, you have to blow dry it. Uh, of course. You, you of course. Need, See, you I need think to. that's the step I'm missing. Yeah. And I don't, I, that's why I don't have the wave. Eddie, I just Eddie. blow on it right now and it would dry. <laughs> and it's just like that. Yeah. Eddie, I think you should try volumizing some shampoo. Volumizing? Yeah, get some more there volume is, in it is, there, there, It does say that on the conditioner, but I'm not going to go into that. And then, after you blow dry it, you have to use paste, not a horse mm -hmm. shampoo. It's a paste. It takes five minutes. Just like that. Well, that's good. Now we know. This, the mystery of John Fisher's hair has been solved. You need that's some. You need some right. Yeah. Right, right there. Right there. Right there. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Because if Matt, it doesn't blow like that, then you're doing the right thing. Doesn't your okay. Well, hair have a unfortunately, twitter? according to it Paul, does. we are very late on time. Paul's such a bummer. So Matt, Buzz you don't get your last topic. <laughs> you know and in the absence of Caleb, ladies and gentlemen, this has been Flashcast. Wow, we'll that, was that was terrible. That was terrible. Are you supposed to end it? Yeah, I was supposed to. You're not doing your job. Is that